Woods, the uh, from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. We were talking about honey. He said he got somebody right down the road from him that uh, that uh, has honey, has beehives, and uh, we got uh, yeah, uh, Stonewall Acres here. You know, Stewart. We get our honey from local. So I'm gonna do a. Uh, I told CJ just give a shout out to CJ because one fine human being there. Um, we talk on the regular, so. I'm gonna do a citrus honey chicken. And uh, so, what we're gonna do first, uh, what I do with that chicken? Hold on one second. Cheese grater. I didn't make music with this thing. You watch your fingers. So that's for you, CJ. And uh, so we're gonna grate a, grate a little bit of uh, orange rind. I don't even know if this is coming through. So we're gonna do it. Yeah, better. I do a little bit of a then we're gonna do a little bit of a A little bit of citrus on it. A little bit of lemon. A little bit of blackened seasoning. Good flavor on both sides. So let that set up for just a minute. And, uh, a little bit of salt and pepper. And uh, I just want to say, you know, it's uh, awful quiet around here. Looks like it's the last couple days. Um, the state's probably going to uh, shelter in place. And I just want to give a, you know, just wish everybody to stay safe. Heed, heed the government's warnings, the CDC's warnings. Every, you know, some people are saying, oh, it's no big deal. But, you know, we're, you know we have relatives over in Italy. Naples, Italy, that um, in the military, and uh, it's serious over there. And they're just uh, nothing, nothing to be, uh, you know. Now they're saying younger uh, people at four was just like my age, 60, 70, 80, 90, just you know having all the issues. Um, so you know we're down to a couple days here at the restaurant. We hope to keep it going. Uh, if you want to become a, a member of uh, Daddy Jack's uh, Cooking with the Blues, yeah, where it's. Uh, you can uh, sign up. We just uh, created launched a, a Patreon page. Uh, whether it be a dollar a month, five dollars a month, ten, whatever, uh, you'd, you'd feel like uh, supporting us. Uh, we're going to continue to we'll try to pay our rent, pay the all utilities. Uh, we have money left over. We're, we're going to be uh, probably be cooking a lot for the soup kitchens and the uh, uh, people in need. Uh, we're going to always try to stay here, providing food and do what we know how to do and cook. So. Uh, it's uh, patreon.com slash cooking with the blues. Yeah, I haven't got that down yet. It's still new to me. We just uh, Lakeisha Lee on the camera here, my partner, and uh, she just uh, my IT specialist also. And uh, I'm kind of uh, that generation is not really IT savvy. So, but uh, anyway, um, uh, CW, this is for you, okay? And. Uh, so I brought some honey from home. Now, it's, to me, just I don't want it that hot. So, like, I always love to do this: cool your pan down if you got too much heat. And somebody told me the exact term on it. I've got to write it down. Why, why, why it chases itself or doesn't? You know, I just love that. I've always, I love that. <laughs> I always get a kick out of that. Right there you are. Cool your pan down a little bit, and uh, still plenty hot. And then uh, put honey in there. And uh,
cook on the natural flavors, reduce it down. It cooks quick because that All that natural flavor. We want to reduce that down so it's just nothing but a glaze. You can see it's almost, almost there. I'm going to turn the fire down. We're just going to reduce it down a little bit. We'll be right back. Okay, here we are. Chicken is ready. So easy. And we're going to taste it because it's a new recipe for me. I thought about it last night with CJ. CJ, we're talking about honey and Dominic and Fort Worth used to do a, a fish. Fish cooked this way. Don't stick your finger into the taste, and I'll tell you what, because that's like a caramel. It's a caramel kind of hot right there. One more piece. One more piece of butter. So the color is darkening, the more we reduce it down. Yeah, when you do that, always, whenever you finish cooking a caramel or whatever, make it easy, make your clean up a little easier. Put on the stove. If you didn't do that, put on the stove, and that that'll make your cleanup a whole lot easier. You don't want that caramel to set up. You could actually put that in a real stock. You know that caramel color. Look at it already set up. Um, then bring me a knife, Lakeisha. Okay, back it up a little bit. Citrus cut through the lemon, but the lemon cut through the honey rather. Put a piece of, I think you can eat it because they're almost kind of like a candied lime, the lemon. This would be good with a little basmati rice. Daddy Jack's coming with the blues. And uh, here it is, CJ, CJ Wood down at Baton Rouge. I love people in Louisiana. It's, it's, it reminds me kind of people around here in Connecticut, uh, New, New London, and New England. You know, it, uh, you know, I don't know, we got kind of the same heritage, you know, or Canada, or Acadians, uh, French Canadians, Acadians came down through, Italians, and uh, you know, just uh, everybody stay well, uh, try to stay healthy, you know, keep keep your circle tight, uh, you know, uh, 
you know, learn how to be at home and uh, be self-sufficient as much as possible. Uh, CJ's planting a garden down there, he was telling me about it. I think it's important everybody grow a little garden. Maybe raise some chickens, uh, raise a pig, or, you know, I mean, just uh, get back to basics, I think. And uh, again, if you want to become a member of Daddy Jack's Cooking with the Blues, uh, we just started a Patreon. Uh, we launched a Patreon account. Uh, anything, if you, if you have, the, have the heart and desire, uh, we're doing charitable work with it. Um, it's uh, patreon.com slash cooking with the blues. Uh, a dollar, five dollars, ten dollars a month. You know, it's all good to us, and uh, we'll put it to good use. And uh, continue cooking our videos here on uh, Big Bertha here at the stove. We'll be firing up the wood grill. We're going to be doing some, uh, you know, for Patreon members only, some merchandise giveaways. Um, I'm doing uh, with CDs. Uh, uh, best of Daddy Jacks. We got, uh, I think, uh, eight bands that we've recorded here. A professional recording artist. Some beautiful music. Giving away hats, t-shirts, uh, sharp knife sharpeners. We have, we have buy a bunch of all of these. Uh, they're Chef Master. They will, they will they'll give us a bunch. We'll get an endorsement from them. Give them away. Uh, do private uh, private videos up on a uh, private. Uh, we'll give you the link. On, uh, on the Cooking with the Blues page, Chaplin's Restaurant page, our other page, Chaplin's Restaurant up on YouTube. Uh, and uh, uh, I might do a blog, uh, write, uh, I'll be maybe speaking of an audio blog, uh, I'm writing a cookbook. I'm, uh, I'm pretty far into it. And uh, all about my travels and adventures uh, associated with music and food. and. Uh, but anyway, this is Daddy Jack's Cool with the Blues, Lakeisha Lee on camera, and I know you've done a great job. I mean, uh, we're going to review this uh, footage here a little bit later on. I know it's going to be good. And uh, Daddy Jack's Cool with the Blues here, a beautiful downtown London with the smoke clears. Hope you come visit. Peace.